How did Natalie become a counselor and then the director of the Rocket Lake camp? Uh, uh, I, I think uh, just um, uh, the, the owner of the camp and its chief director as far as things like finances were concerned or the number of children she wanted to have there. I mean, she, she made the big decisions, and they were made long before Natalie came along. But uh, Natalie was hired as a counselor. First she was hired as a junior counselor, the way I was. Uh, and uh, uh, then she was hired, he was, she was promoted as a counselor, and then she was promoted to head counselor. And those were um, just jobs that she uh, realized required certain things of her, and she immediately learned them. I mean, she, she was a naturally born head counselor, and she made it a point to have memorized the name of every single camp of 350 girls by the time the overnight trip was over, so it was about 12 hours. And did she hire you? What? Did she hire you? Yes, she did, but everybody knew that I was going to become a counselor, and then I became what was called a group leader of counselors. Uh, and nobody thought that it was nepotism. You know, I was, uh, as a camper, I was got the award of the Character Cup. I don't know why, because I was not, I was not overflowing with character, uh, and I got the all-around camper cup, which I did deserve, and um, so I was, I was a, a, a very good person for any job in that camp.